What up, Miss Poopin' in a Bucket? You about an idiot. You know that? You are so ignorant. I swear. You probably didn't even go to kindergarten. They put your ass up out of there because you, you couldn't learn anything. You're about an idiot. An idiot, an idiot. I just can't get over. Man. <laughs> You're hilarious, really. You amuse me. Your comments, they amuse me, so... Keep on keeping on. As far as me being a lion junkie, bitch, you wish I was a junkie. Them days are gone. And you're hating it. All y'all that send those nasty comments, you're hating it. Because I'm getting my life together. And it's coming together so very well. <laughs> woo -hoo. Ain't that right, Abbers? Ain't that right, Abigail? Say, yep, that's right, mamas. That's right. They're big dummies, huh, Abbers? Big old dummies. Hold on, Abby. I'm trying to light this candle. Wait a minute. Yeah, anyways, I, I was looking through the comments, y'all, and I, I, it's amusing to me. It, it is. It's, it's funny to me. Because you know what? All that tells me is that the ones that are making these negative comments, they're jealous. I am I am showing them that, yes, people can change. People do change. And I'm continuously changing. I'm forever changing. For the better. And y'all can't stand it. Sure hate it. Sure hate it. I can't wait to put all my clean drug screens in order. And, and so that I can show all you haters. Woo! I can't wait. I would do it now. But guess what? I don't feel like digging all them pet that paperwork out. But I got it. Trust me, I do. I just got another one today. Woo! -hoo! And all you negative haters are hating on me. And you're hating on Maddie, too. That's why you say Maddie's still pooping in the bucket. Because she's on methadone. Y'all are hating on Maddie, too. That's that's terrible. Why wouldn't you be happy? For people, for somebody that's changing their life and getting their life together, why would you hate? I bet you I know why. Because you're in the closet with your addiction, see? That's why. Me, I'm going to keep it 100. Yeah, buddy, keeping it 100. I've been, I've been keeping it real from day one. From the very first time... Tommy Boy, the very first time T-Boy interviewed me, I kept it 100. I ain't got no reason to lie. I'm grown. I don't have to lie. But I make videos like the one I'm making right now just to piss you guys off. That's all. I like pissing you guys off. Mm-hmm. And I know, I know, I know. I can't wait to get my place, you guys. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to poke your eyes out. Woo, y'all are going to be really, really hating. Oh my goodness, you're going to be hating. And you know what? You need to leave Frank Nitty alone. And that ain't no, that, I'm serious. You need to leave him alone. Y'all have picked and picked and picked at him enough. Shoot. Yeah, I've known Frank Nitty a long time. He's a good parent. And uh, he's a good guy. So you need to leave him alone. And as far as him lying, he ain't got no reason to lie. So, I mean, he's grown. That's not how he gets down. Lying. But I see that that's how y'all get down. Bunch of liars. In the closet liars. And that's your guys' problem. You ain't got enough balls to, to tell the truth. Whereas me, on the other hand, I got big balls. And I tell the truth all the time. I can't wait to get my book published. Woo! You haters, you ain't going to be able to get it. Mm -mm. Nope. I'm going to make it to where you have to order it online. Mm-hmm. 
Yep. I mean, my book's going to be so good. I'm even going to have a book signing. It's going to be a number one seller. Watch. Think I'm bullshitting you, huh? And then there's going to be more books after that. Self-help books. Oh, yeah. See, this is one thing y'all don't know about me. I am so intelligent. It's ridiculous. My grandfather used to tell me, you can do anything you want. You can be anything you want. You just got to, you know, quit doing the dumb shit and, and, and put all that energy into the positive stuff. And you, yeah, my grandfather used to tell me that it might've took me a while to let that sink in, but it's there now and it's never too late, never too late. And I thank God for my health. I thank God that I still have my brains and I'm still intelligent, you know, because of all the chemicals I have put in my body and keeping it real, my, I should be fried. My brain should be fried and it's nowhere near that. And I thank God for that every day. Yeah. So, <clears throat> and I'm college bound. Aw, you haters don't like that either, huh? Ooh. Mm-mm-mm. Y'all ought to be ashamed of yourself. Y'all can do it too. You know what I mean? Come out of the closet. Get you some help. Get on some boxing or whatever, you know, subutex. Or... I wouldn't get on methadone because that's hard to get off of too. But to each their own, you know. If it helps you get off the street drugs, hey, just come out of the closet. And go get an education. But see, y'all would have to start back in grade school. That's how ignorant y'all are. You have to start back in kindergarten. First grade. Maybe preschool. I don't know. But, um, yeah. Just watch. Just watch what I do. From, the, from, from here on out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be poking your eyes out on a daily basis. All you haters on a daily basis. Poking your eyes out on a daily basis. Y'all are really going to hate me. <laughs> I'm loving it too. Because I can remember the very first video I made. I was hit. I was just tore down. Woo, I was tore down. But you know what? By the grace of God. And with all my peeps that still embrace me. Pray for me. And are still in my corner. I'm doing the damn thing. And I'm going to keep doing the damn thing. Because I like me today. I love me today. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And I even have love for you haters. I just don't like y'all. God says I have to love you. But I don't have to like you. And I don't. So, with that being said, stay tuned because there's more. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for listening and watching. And peace out.